بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته peace be with you we are reaching the 27th day of Ramadan the 27th section and in this section we find something which is quite important from the Islamic perspective when it comes to the teachings that we have in the Quran the teaching uh, the teaching that have to do with our life as human beings and as believers. What we find is in one of the chapters, one of the sword, which is the one that the Prophet, peace be upon him, liked very much. He was even uh, uh, calling it Arusat al-Qur'an, which is uh, the bribe of the Qur'an. It, he's talking here about uh, something which is essential. And if you come back to this, Rahman, the most merciful, we find something which is وَالسَّمَاءَ رَفْعَهَا وَوَضْعَ الْمِزَانِ أَلَّا تَطْغَوْ فِي الْمِزَانِ وَأَقِيمُوا الْوَزْنَ بِالْقِسْطِ وَلَا تُخْسِرُوا الْمِزَانِ And the sky, uh, the, the heavens, he raised it high and he established the balance in order for you not to neglect the balance. So do not neglect the balance. وَأَقِيمُوا الْوَزْنَ بِالْقِسْطِ is just set the balance with equity and do not neglect the balance. Meaning here that the balance is essential in the way we look at ourselves, in the way we look at life, and the, in the way we look at uh, the creation itself. So yes, we have to be full of balance. We have to come back to this balance with equity. And this balance means what? Is yes, you ha there is life after life, and you should not look back this life, this life here, the one that you have now. You should be respectful towards your mind and you should be respectful towards your uh, body. You should be respectful of yourself as an individual and you should be respectful of the community. Balance is one of the most difficult things to get. It's one of the most difficult things to get when it comes to ourselves. How are we going to get this balance? It's a struggle, it's a jihad of balance, is how do you try to resist all the excesses that you find and you feel inside your heart, inside your, 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 your feelings and your emotions. You master this in order to find uh, wisdom and wisdom it's all about balancing, it's all about knowing what you can get here, knowing what you should expect there, knowing to be alone, knowing how to deal with your fellow human beings. It's all about this balance. So Islam is all about this and it's bringing us to establish this balance with equity. Be just because it has to do with justice. This is why the symbol of justice is this balance that we have everywhere. This is the spiritual life. This is wisdom. al hikma has to do with this. And as human beings, as believers, this is what we need to get. And in our world today, when you look at uh, consumption, when we look at uh, during Ramadan, we understand that we are resisting all kinds of excesses because it's all about balancing, not eating too much, not drinking too much, being aware of who we are through the way we are dealing with the elements and with nature and with human beings around us. Be a man and a woman of measure, of wisdom, of balance. This is the very understanding of our faith as Muslims and this is what we have to bring uh, to the world more balance, meaning more wisdom. May Allah help us. Don't forget to tell the people you love that you love them. Life is fragile. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.